Tante le emozioni vissute durante l'ultima giornata del girone di andata, una vittoria di spessore di Reggio Emilia in casa Trento, Varese e Sassari che superano ancora una volta quota 100 punti segnati e una tripla da maestro di Teodosic che sigilla così la vittoria della Virtus contro Venezia. E così il quadro delle Final 8 è completo, l'ultima a staccare un pass per Torino è stata Brescia. Gianni Milano che chiude il girone d'andata da sola al primo posto della classifica e tra i protagonisti dell'ultima vittoria contro Tortona c'è anche Mitru Long per gli amici Naz. Conosciamolo meglio. So today I'm in Milan with Naz Mitru Long. Nice to meet you, how are you doing? I'm good, I'm good, how are you? Not so bad. Good. I want to start with you from the past with a 15 year old guy away from his family to follow his dreams. I know it had been difficult with a lot of tears but I bet you will do the same. I would, I would. Um, learned a lot from then and ultimately got me here in this position right now. So I'm very thankful for uh, my parents and that young child for just pursuing his dreams and having a corner who uh, allowed him to do so. Nice. And what about your career in Europe? Because you are doing so well, but you stay a lot of here in the US. You will do also the same? Um, the plan, honestly, is, is just to kind of just stay present, um, take whatever is given to me. Um, I felt like it was the right time to make a move and I just so happened to land in one of the most beautiful countries in the world, in Italy. Last year was great in Brescia, we did a lot of great things and um, I couldn't be any more happy to be here in Milan right now. Um, easily one of the best cities I've ever been in. Uh, anything you need is here and then this culture as far as organization goes top to bottom is first class. So, um, you know, I'm very thankful for my journey and just taking what's given. Very nice. So let's take a look maybe at the future, not at the past. Uh, what about the future? Because you did such a great season last season and you have any particular goal for this season or only win? Yeah, just to win, just to win. <laughs> um, you know, you come to Milan to be a champion, uh, ultimately to, to be in the historic books and to contribute. Um, we've had our fair shares of ups and also lows in this season and, uh, you know, we're still going. We have yet to play with a full roster. Um, we just want to be champions. I want to be a champion and that's the ultimate reason why I came here to Milan. Nice, so keep going. Uh, what about you? Because I think family can be one of the words to describe yourself, correct me if I'm wrong. Uh, the other two? Um, to describe myself, yeah. I am... I'm very, I'm very, um, I would say disciplined in regards to my regiment. Mm -hmm. um, I don't like to go outside of my routine. So with what I eat, um, what I sleep, anything that has to do with my job in basketball. So like, very focused. Very, I'm very yeah. obsessed with basketball. Like I, I really, really am. And it's kind of a problem. I need to find balance, but I, I am. Um, and then the other thing I would say that makes me me, um, I don't know, I, I, I like to give off positive energy. Okay. Um, just to kind of make people feel good. Um, uplift people. Um, I think that's something that is, is invaluable um, and not something that I was taught. So, I mean, I guess selflessness maybe? Yeah. Yeah, I would Very say Very nice. That. So, good luck for the rest of the season. Appreciate you. Thank you. La prima giornata del girone di ritorno si apre alla Vitri Frigo Arena con Pesaro che sfida Verona, tra l'altro vi consiglio di tenere d'occhio le divise dei giallorossi. Giornata poi che si conclude con il match Napoli-Sassari, super sfida da seguire in chiaro su Dimax, canale 52 sarà Trento-Varese.